Why in the world would you be mean to a disabled person? Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So a video went viral on Twitter and I, that video made me so sad, like, and the video made me, prompted me to make this video. How much does an act of kindness cost? The video showed a young boy with a disability, so he was much smaller than an average, a normal nine-year-old child should be. It showed him um, crying, crying hysterically. So is there any advice or support or anything that other parents or, you know, families have done to help raise disability awareness and education within the school so that this doesn't happen? I've got some good advice, but I need more because this is the effect of bullying. This is what it's doing. And I want people to know how much it is hurting us as a family. I want people to educate their children. The whole anti-bullying shit isn't fucking working. And I've got a son that is suicidal almost every single day. Every time there's a triggering... Anything that happens at school or in public which is almost every time we're in public and we're about to head into a shopping center now. <laughs> and I wish that I could record everything that, every instant when we're in public or have a hidden camera so that people could see. And this is the side that I don't choose to share. I, I choose to keep this private, but we can't do it anymore. We try to be as strong and positive as possible and only share the highlights, but this is how bullying affects a nine-year-old kid. And I've got to constantly keep my eye on him because of the suicide attempts. This is what bullying does, people. I've already called the school. I've, it's been several times Every time there's a new kid that's not aware of Quaden's condition, it's bullying. So we just went to pick him up and we saw a student patting him on the head and making fun of his height. And I said, do you want me to do something about it? He ran to the car in hysterics because he doesn't want me to make a scene at the school. And God knows I will. His mom was also talking and you could hear the hot and the pain in his mom's voice. Now, I wonder why anyone would bully anyone. And if at all you want to even bully anyone, why would it be um, someone with a disability? Do you know how difficult it is for their families and for those people to live a normal life? You can't even create someone. So why would you demean someone? Why would you make someone feel so terrible? How much exactly does an act of kindness cost? Like, it made me wonder. And you know the funny thing about that video is, he's a nine-year-old child. So, that means those that are bullying him are with age range or plus or minus two years. Are these the kind of children we're raising? I begin to fear that children, um, the children being raised these days will be no different. It feels like as, as, as we keep growing, the cycle continues. There's one menace to the other. Why, why can't people, uh, and this, this is a message to parents out there. Trooping your child, I mean, how much does it cost? How much does it cost to, to be kind to your neighbor, to the person beside you? I just feel like this is a wake up call to people. We don't want, the previous mistakes of the past to continue happening. That video was so sad. How much does an act of kindness cost? How much? How difficult is it for you to love your neighbor, for you to be kind, for you to be to be nice? You don't have to be best of friends to be good to someone. 
you don't have to be like like the bible says love does not judge love love is patient love is kind even if all, all of this does not apply to you why in the world would you be mean to a disabled person do you know how difficult it is for them imagine the number of stories like this that is going on the number of stories like this that we can't see because maybe those people don't have access to social media this is a wake up call this is this is a call for we all to change and i feel like this message is befitting because this is february the month of love and we don't just love in the month of february we love all months round. we love in january february march till december we don't just stop our love at in february that video was so sad it was really really sad i'm thankful because I later saw that um, actions were taken, in fact the friendly match was organized for him, his mom took him to the person's store where he got his ear pierced and he smiled, I was so happy, like you, you can feel the joy after you know things changed and his face glowed, everyone deserves love, be kind to your neighbor, an act of kindness costs nothing. Finally. Talking about kindness and all that stuff, another video went viral on Twitter. If you're not following me at this point, I wonder what you're doing. I'll put my handle on the screen. Another video went viral too this past week and it showed a, a lady who had a very crazy shit of like. I'll put in the video now. The way maybe her mental space was 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 also not healthy, so she couldn't arrange her room, clean up herself. She was just from here to there. I think she was working six jobs. Friends came in, and as you had seen from the video, they came in and they helped her clean her room. Now that's what we are talking about. The the mark they've etched in that lady's heart will never be forgotten. They helped her in a time of need, and that's what life is all about: helping people, being a shoulder to lean on, being a shoulder to cry on. So I am enjoying all of you watching this video at this point. First of all, if you've gotten to this point in this video, please like, please share, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you. So I'm enjoying you guys. Uh, be kind. That's just the message. An act of kindness costs nothing. Okay? Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. Have a good day. Bye.